Hey folks, it's Steve with Prima Coffee. Today we're taking a look at Baratza's Virtuoso Plus coffee grinder. It is a replacement for the long-loved and time-tested Virtuoso. It's got some really nice updates that it brings to the table, plus a lot of the same old features that we already love. So uh, again, this is a replacement for the old Virtuoso. Um, internally, it's pretty much the same old grinder. What Baratza have done uh, is basically just bring some new updates to the grinder, make it a little bit more user-friendly, um, and solve some of the issues that they were seeing with the Virtuoso in terms of uh, overall use and um, kind of expectations from how it works. So it looks, pretty much exactly the same. You'll notice that we now, instead of a little timer knob on the side, have a digital timer on the front. Um, and then th that is the first of a couple different upgrades that we've added to the Virtuoso Plus. Um, instead of that dial timer, we now have a digital timer that can be adjusted from one to 40 seconds in 10th of a second increments. Uh, turning the dial one way will add full seconds and turning it back will uh, basically remove one tenth of a second at a time. So if you want that precision, it's available. Um, if you don't really care, or you're even single dosing your, um, your grinder, you can just kind of set it wherever you need it. There is also a pulse mode function. So instead of uh, using the dial, I can just hold down the button until P shows on the screen. And then I can just hit it again and hold it for as long as I need to actually grind that coffee. Um, you'll also probably notice that we've got some lights down below. Um, and that is a really nice feature. Honestly, we'd love to see it on a lot of other, or Baratza's other grinders. Um, but the lights are there along with a new, kind of more transparent grinds bin to make it easier to see how full this has gotten. Um, Baratza noted that, you know, sometimes people would forget how much coffee was actually in the grinds bin and they'd continue to grind. And sometimes it would, it would get backed up into the burrs and cause some damage to the motors. So uh, it's a lot harder to make that mistake if you have a very clear grind spin and some lights to show you how much coffee is actually in there. Um, so between those two, those are our two major upgrades to this grinder. Inside, we still have 40 millimeter conical steel burrs. We still have 40 grind adjustment settings uh, that you can access by twisting the hopper. Um, we still got basically the same grind range from a pretty fine like AeroPress or single cup V60 up to French press. Um, and we've also got the same eight ounce hopper up top and five ounce ground spin down below. Uh, we also still have some of that heft that the Virtuoso is known for. It's a very robust kind of mid-range uh, level consumer grinder. Um, you can basically expect the same exact grind quality out of this as the previous Virtuoso. Um, and you know, it's just a fairly modest price increase for the, the upgrades that we've got here. So overall, um, pretty much the same Virtuoso that we already kind of have grown to love uh, with a couple of nice little features that make it a little bit easier to use um, whether you're a novice or a professional. So that's the Baratza Virtuoso Plus. Thanks for watching, guys. Hey guys, thanks for watching the video. If you wanna see more content like this, we've got all kinds of product overviews, comparisons, recipes, events coverage, and more. Feel free to subscribe, like, share this video, and let us know what you think in the comments.